Hello and welcome to FIFA 12. Today we are doing something a little bit differently because team of the season is just around the corner. But we don't care about informs. We don't care about team of the seasons. We don't want a team of the season Pogba. What we want is a bronze Pogba. That is right, Paul Pogba on FIFA 12 had a 55 rated bronze card and look at those stats for a bronze as well. What you need to remember is that on FIFA 12, handicap was 100% a thing. Bronze cards, if they came up against the gold team, played ridiculous, like they pushed all of the stats up so that they could compete with the golds. Look at this guy's stats anyway. 79 pace, 70 dribbling, 70 shooting, and 75 defending on a bronze. Are you having a Lafayette? What were you smoking when you designed this guy's card? I have got no idea. But there he is. And then you put him against the gold team, and he plays like he's got 99 in every stat. It is ridiculous. He originally started off as a 55 rated card, but he was terrible. And he probably had stats that are even worse than 55. He had 38 dribbling, 34 shooting, 46 passing, 58 defending and 48 heading. He had 21 long shots, which is just madness. And then for some reason, EA, in January, gave him an upgrade. They didn't upgrade his overall rating. They just went fucking mental and doubled all of his stats. And this right here is what we ended up with. We are going to jump into a game and take a look at some of this guy's crazy in-game stats. 99 ball control on a 55 rated bronze player, okay, yeah. 91 curve, 89 free kick accuracy, 91 penalties, 99 shot power. Holy shit, okay, what else have we got? We've got 99 agility, 99 balance, 99 stamina, 77 strength, 81 sprint speed, we've got 88 aggression, holy shit, this guy is ridiculous, and just, just while we're on the the part of taking a look at bronze players as well. We're obviously going to have to sub off someone to put in Pogba, but it's not going to be this pal guy, because look at him as well! 97 curve, 90 finishing. What EA? I don't know what EA are smoking when they're making these teams. So what we're going to do, we're going to move Powell to left midfield, and we're going to bring in Pogba at camp and tear some shit up. Sinclair powering down the line. He spotted Pogba, though. He's given it off to him. He's turned. 99 shot power. Ooh, the keeper just got a hand on it. Oh, don't rage quit. It's nil-nil. Oh my god, he's rage quit at nil-nil. Are you joking? What's the point? Oh, you dickhead. You've wasted one of my, con my contracts as well. Okay, opponent number two is also kind of a starter team. So hopefully, we can actually get a game out of this fella and score some goals. Oh, we've slotted Sinclair through. We're going to pass it back. We only want to score with Pogba. Where is he? Oh, tits. The lag, man. This is why you don't play someone called, like, Uman or something, because he's obviously from the other side of the bloody world, and the connection's dreadful. Oh, Pogba. Get out of my way. He's going through. He's powering. Bloody... West car getting in the way, what's he doing? Oh my god, the lag man! Oh, for god's sake, I keep forgetting that. that you have to press L2. Come on, this game! We've scored, but look at the lag, it's so stupid. Oh, for god's sake. Right, third time's a charm against another bloody starter team, come on. This card is absolutely bizarre because he's got 99 ball control. So his first touch is magic every single time. It's perfect. But then he's only got like 51 dribbling. So it's like turning a bin lorry sometimes. I don't know what is going on. I don't know what EA would do when they made this card. Something funky. Look, perfect first touch. And it's like steering a bus. Boom! Ah. Oh. 99 shot power, but he couldn't get it on target. Go on, Pogba, keep going, keep going. Oh my god, he couldn't finish his dinner. He couldn't finish his dinner. I'll tell you, who can finish his dinner though. Not West Car. Not West Car, boys. <laughs> I was going to say West Car. He's ridiculously good. Gordon, I can though. 
Finally, we got ourselves a goal. They took our centre of the fence with me, Craig Gardner, to bash it in the back of the net. Oh, for God's sake. Juicy has just scored a header against us. There was no defence against that at all. FIFA 12 crosses. There you go, boys. Oh, Paul. Go on, son. Go on, son. Oh, my God. Kick it in the goal. It was open. Please kick it in the goal this time. Oh, thank God. Smashed it past the keeper. The first one. They're all blister and just rockets. That was the first one he got in a decent shot on target. Oh, he's dived into the box. He's passed three. And he's tucked it away in the 90th minute for his second goal of the game. Turns out he's not actually as amazing as you would think because it's bloody brilliant to have a 99 shot power. But when you've got 50 long shots, it's not quite as good. And it's insane having 99 ball control. But when you've got 50 dribbling, it doesn't quite work. But... He is still a pretty decent player, and for a bronze, his stats are just absolute madness. This game is about to come to an end, so I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you have and you would like to see some more retro videos, oh god, don't score, mate. There we go. Make sure you drop a like on this video, and I'll bring some more to you. Maybe about FIFA 12 El Sharawi or some FIFA 13 ones. I don't know, it's up to you guys, whatever you want to see. Like I said, 55 long shots, that is what you get. Make sure you smash the like button. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.